Oh, look at that, a brand. These guys are somewhat rare. Hmm. The plan here is just to play like three cards, then after that give it up. Okay. But he obviously wants the tempo. Special prize, just for you, love. The problem is if I play, even if I play two smugglers, I don't really have too much to follow it up with. That's annoying. It's still justify playing the smugglers. Show me the coin or sod off. Getting some points. Hmm. Hey, listen here. He listen actually well. has clear skies. Holy crap. Okay, can I take it in four cards? That should be possible. <laughs> May your sword and arm be one. But this doesn't look too promising. Cross the wide somber sea, I will sail. Okay, two point guy versus thirty three points. Yeah, that's a pass. Creatures, please. Need them to go away. Uh not this. No witchers. Why can I not find the witchers now? You would regret discarding that clear skies. What if he has two? A Chimiris Coral deck. He probably has Lippy too. Possible. Oh my god, he's gonna get back clear skies. He knows what's up. I wanna see your graveyard. Why can't I check it now? Why can't I only check his graveyard when it's actually my turn to act? This should be my time to actually act, not like look at your graveyard. <sighs> Alright. I just tried to discourage him. Well, I guess it's gonna take some more passion. Puffy is my scare card. My crumpled ground steps livelier than you. So he does have clear skies in the deck now. And the Witchers has those two. Hit that. Dole! Blasana! Ah. Uh, I suppose, and the end. Hey Tom. 
That's what he said. So he discarded the clear skies again. No respect for spores. Question is, how do we fight this? I can play this for 5, we also hit, so that's te technically a 10, but then I would need to do 8, well we're gonna be at 10, and then I would technically need to do kinda like 8, yeah 8, with one card. If I play Ragnarok, he's probably just gonna pass. But this Can does make Groover's movement pretty strong. So, I can get some good value with movement. I'm just kinda hoping that's gonna discourage him, though. I can actually play one Crushing Trap. And this is gonna represent 11 points. This guy. You wanna lose a card? Actually, we should have played the... Well, it doesn't matter where we play the Crushing Trap. We, if we play it on the front, we could uh, pretend that it's a Mahakam Horn. Wow. So we are hitting that for sure. And other than that, it's, it's a 12. We had 19. If I get out the other crushing trap, it's gonna be good. Just getting this out is not good enough. Mahakam Horn. So you would need to be crushing trap plus something. He actually doesn't have, doesn't know that I didn't get a crushing trap. Is there a way to still make Crushing Trap reality. Well, not, not Crushing Trap, but like winning a reality. If I move him in the front, then we're gonna get plus 8. Well, actually plus 4. I don't think that's... I think I gotta do it. So close yet so far. But we did use a lot of traps. So throw this out. A fire pass. Got lucky. Use order. Uh, doesn't matter. If you use it, we have to use a card anyway. Well, oh, this is actually tricky. If we get crushing trap, then it's good. If not, we have to money get away. Uh, Rihi Dragoon. Be actually good, but we have a lot of movements. I have to kick your vet. We might get a Witcher here. So this is just bad. We can start with Elven Swordmaster. As as smile, this guy played really well. He already got out Roach. Don't 
Don't you pester me. We know for a... F well, actually, yeah. Doesn't have commander, so... Sure. But I don't have crushing trap. He doesn't have commander's horn. He can play this for nine, play this for free. Never gonna get any better. He can move his guys. Doesn't matter too much. Maybe he's just gonna... Maybe this Alvin Scott is just gonna bait some removal. You should not have come here. Also triggers the Swordmaster. This is a tough game, guys. Onward, fry head. I just make sure he burns in the fire. They can hide, but there is no escape. Go the scald. I wasn't really saving the best card for last. But I guess we could have uh, expected uh, Camby. Damn! What a spicy deck! I'm impressed. This was a fun deck to play against. GG. Boltist. This guy tends to care about... Uh, Having last say. Yeah, let's go with this. If I play the smuggler, it might just get killed. But let's just do that. I don't I don't necessarily think he's gonna go and uh, rush in a gunter to take out the smuggler. Round one. Basically, we have two ways to play this. Either we just like Smuggler, Witcher, Archer, Pass. Or, that's that's pretty good. At that point, he can just like use five cards, take round one, go for a long ground free. Where he has last say, and he might think that's just fine. By the way, we're not running into any Brewers. Brewers, where are you? Ah, uh, we can play the Swordmaster. Yes. Let us sing the song of steel. Not great, but fine. It makes our maybe tempo pass plan a little bit less obvious. We're probably gonna follow it up with an archer. That's good. They can hide, but there is no escape. He's not in a great spot now. I wouldn't be surprised if he passes.
You got a 12 point lead. Admittedly, partly because of tactical advantage. Okay, 18 point lead. He can uh, rush out uh, uh, impactful order unit. South Kirk would be good. Counter, maybe overkill. Although the smuggler is dangerous. Think about the past, man. Death to the enemy! Okay, I'm passing. We got a 10 point lead. All right. Still a 10 point lead. Doesn't have Roach. Regroup. So with a card down, it's gonna be a bit tricky to try to push us round two. I don't think he's gonna attempt it. Which is just fine. Exactly what we want. Uh, crushing Trap goes away. What do we want? Afko could be good. Yorvet could be better. Smuggler would be better than what we have. Overall, yeah, I just throw away the sentry. That's what. Now we can play the Swordmaster here. May your sword and arm be one. <laughs> Who are your vet? Throw away a sentry, we can't have crushing trap, we can't have crushing trap. This is great. We don't have Pafko, but it doesn't matter. Uh, we can start with the sentry. What do you guys think about the sentry? What about those... wait... question marks? Where's your question, mate? What do you guys think about the sentry? Yay or nay? Is this guy really carrying his uh, weight? Or he's just uh, more of a scare... maybe... removal bait? Or maybe just completely useless for? Give me this. We can kill that. And that dies too. Ah! And why not? Just get rid of uh, that dumb value generation. Okay, I'm I like the card, but I run Nivellan over Pafko. I just don't try to go all in on any particular strategy, because these guys often we don't need Nivellan. And uh, Nivellan could be okay with the sentry, the but sometimes we just don't have the sentry. Oh my god. Anything that's a, a 5, or mostly a 4, but even as a 5 uh, or less, it's just uh, pretty much irrelevant and basically can be considered like it's in the fire. You 
will see it in your dream. Really? What do you want to give immune? And I gotta be careful here because. <clears throat> I need to line up. Okay. Well, we can play a pitfall trap. What do you want to give immune? <laughs> Show me. Move it, move this it. No! His artifact removal didn't work. So bad. That's why it's a pretty good idea to start with Pitfall Trap early uh, first. Because if they have artifact removal, they'll do it. They'll always use it on it. They, they just don't try to meta game you like, oh, but. They might be like pitfall trapping as the first move because you know I have artifact removal. They never do that. If they have artifact removal, they're playing it on the first bloody trap every single time. We can just throw this in the fire. Die! I love doing that. Had someone waste an eye on it. <laughs> we can throw it into the fire. Instant action. Do nothing. <laughs> Holy crap. I didn't realize that he's gonna use it. Wait, what? It's my turn now? This guy is pretty damn desperate. <clears throat> Crap. Pretty innocent. Just, just play your stuff, man. Scorch Foltest. Really? Oh, he can scorch my the trapper. <laughs> Maybe he has a Hubert. What am I doing? Onward, fry head! Ah! Oh, what? I may have messed up. The trap trigger. Hit the right one. Damn. We lost two points. And the respect that we can clean up the board. I may be not taking this game as super seriously. For me. No, you got one point. We got one other point. 
That's a win. At least he had another guy to give the point to. GG. Ooh, another realm.